Hi, my name is Kim Carlisle, and we live near Sheridan, Indiana. We have a shop full of Heise glassware for sale. We're open at this time, but only by appointment due to the COVID-19 crisis. This is the time of year for the usual annual Heise convention in Newark, Ohio. However, this year, which was going to be the 49th year of convention, it was canceled due to the COVID-19 crisis. Collectors spend hundreds of dollars each year traveling to and from convention on hotels, gas, airlines, food, and registration fees, but not this year. Because of COVID, you won't be incurring all those extra expenses. Over the next six days, we're going to show you the items we would have brought to the convention this year. Each morning at 8 a.m., we will show you a short video of tables and cases filled with Heise. Each case has a number on it, and each table has a number on it. We will mention the table number or the case number as we go through the price of each item. If you see something that interests you or you have questions, email us or give us a call. We're in the dealer directory in the back of the Heise News. Another savings this year for you will be sales tax. Only Indiana residents will pay sales tax. Since our show lasts six days, there is no need to settle up each day. What you buy on one day will be put aside for you until Saturday. At that time, we can total up all your items. As an added incentive this year, if you purchase $200 or more of Isaac, we will ship your glass for a flat rate of $10 per carton. Also, we offer layaway at six months, same as cash. If you subscribe to our YouTube channel, you can get future notifications of our videos. If you have any questions or concerns, please just contact us. Hope you enjoy the show, and good luck, and goodbye. Welcome to day number four of our online Heise convention show. Today, we're gonna to be showing you case number nine, and case number 10, and tables number five, and tables number six. We're going to start first with case number nine. We're going to start out with the Zircon Saturn Comport at 425. Two Alexanderite Creole grapefruits, $125 each. We have two Navy bar or shot glasses, both of them a little bit different shape, one for $150 and one for $125. Have an aristocrat candy jar, the tall size, and clear with a plain lid on it. It's $175. We have two bells. We have a Victorian bell, and it's $25. And then we have a minuet bell on a Jamestown blank. It's $115. In the back, we have a flamingo helmet basket with a grape and Taglio cutting on it is $2,500. Have a Rand's Head stopper and a Marshall cocktail shaker for $375. Cathedral flared vase in cobalt blue, $685. Have an Orchid sherry decanter for $110. Orchid flat bottom soda, $95. Two Orchid Aqua Calientes, $30 each. A Cobalt Spanish Wine, $85. Duquesne Goblet, Monticelli Cutting, $85. A Flamingo Duck Ashtray, $135. Two Moongleam Ipswich Inserts for the Candle Vases, $175 a piece. Sahara Ipswich Large Candy Jar, $565. Alexandrite Empress Relish or Celery Tray, $95. We have a Winchester Martini Pitcher, a hard to find item, for $1,650. We have the smaller Ipswich Sahara Candy Jar at $325. We have an Empress Flamingo Diamond Ashtray, $65. Old Queen Anne Cruet, $65. Greek Tea, two and a half ounce Cruet, $65. Have an Orchid Blown Vase, $465. Have 
have the orchid number 42, salt and peppers. This is the only salt and pepper that they made. They put orchids on it that has the full orchid. Most of the time on the Waverly's, it always shows just the bow tie. This has the orchid on it, the 325. Have a pair of three light Empire candle holders for 575. Two Empress Alexandrite dolphin footed nets, $95 a piece. We have six Chantelier cocktail glasses with George IV cutting on them for $225 a piece. We have a number six candle socket, which is a hard candle socket, socket to find, and it's $100. We have a Marigold Yeoman cream suit with the Empress Etch on it, no crazy, and it's $65. A thumbprint and panel flared vase in Sahara for $675. A thumbprint and panel flared vase in crystal for $110. Have a Moonbeam Faber vase, $650. Flamingo two piece duck flower frog, $235. A navy plate for $40. We have a Spanish saucer champagne with the Sahara bowl, which is rare. On Spanish, have a Sahara bowl. It's got titanium etch, and it's $265. Putney and Diamond Point, number 305, toothpick holder, $225. A pair of Sanford sticks, and they do have a cutting on them, and I didn't get a price. Hawthorne banded picket basket for $475. Two Gooks cordials. For $75 a piece and a frosted goose cordial for $75. Flamingo Empress Cruet, $65. Alexandrite Dolphin Footed Floral Bowl, $225, and this one does have wear inside the bowl. Here's a very unusual oval salt. It's number 1121, and it is signed on the inside, and it's $55. Here's a Moongleam Empress Cruet, all Moongleam, $125. Whirlpool three light candle holders, $30 for the pair. Flamingo banded flute basket, banded picket basket, excuse me, $225. Have an Oxford cordial with ivy etching, $35. A Barbary Fritchie cordial, no decoration, $45. And a Monte Cristo cordial for $30. Have three Chantelier cocktails, no decoration, $15 a piece. Old William Bird water pitcher, $35. Have a Flamingo Diamond Optic, two handled mayonnaise with a ladle for $15. And the spoon is $17.50. It's also Flamingo. A pair of Essex candlesticks, $125 for the pair. A Dawn Crimp Bowl, $125. A Yeoman Little Footed Mint, $10 in Flamingo. A, the largest size Old William Bird Water Pitcher, $75. And an Empress Sahara Dolphin Footed Candy Dish, $65. Now we're going to go to case 10. Pair of Sahara Empress single light can holders in 125. A Colonial 1776 toothpick holder for $125. The Sahara Empress sticks for $125. In the back we have the Carcassonne water pitcher, Alexandrite top, crystal stem, crystal foot, $3,750. We have a Flamingo Old Sandwich wine. $125. The same item in Moongleam, $145. Between those is a Cobol one quart cocktail shaker with Fox Chase Etch at $125. Now we have another Carcassonne water pitcher. This time it's an all flamingo and it's $375. Have a Waldorf Astoria toothpick holder, $36. An Alexanderite number 1000 marmalade and cover, $750. A 
a mother rabbit, and this one has everything you want in a rabbit, no flaws, it's $2,000. We have eight Duquesne tangerine cocktail glasses, and they're $88 a piece. Two Yeoman Flamingo cruets, and they're $37.50 a piece. Octagon Hawthorne Nut Cup, we have two of them, $18 a piece. And we have 10 Banded Flute Burgundies for $12.50 a piece. Originally shot glass, $14. Cobalt Ipswich Floral Bowl. This goes with the candle, I rose with the candle set for $375. Wampum Cigarette Box, $85. A Continental Toothpick Holder, $25. Now we have a rare item here. It's a Dawn Old Fashioned with screen optic in it, in coronation pattern, and it's $375. A plug horse and honey amber, $475. Two Alexandrite Carcasson flagons for $225 a piece. Have six Bannon Rooster cocktail glasses. This is the full body rooster, not the head or just the head with the tail up the air. That's a full body, and they're $275 a piece. Have Duquesne Salsa Champagnes and Tangerine, and they're $95 a piece, and we have seven of them. Here's an unusual piece. We have a groove and slash tobacco jar signed in the middle of the bottom and it has a very ornate Art Deco or Art Nouveau lid on it. And it's $650. Have a wings roll custard ring tree, no decoration, $425. Octagon flamingo nut, $8. And we have three beer mugs, and these are the smaller size beer mugs. We have a Cobalt Blue for $265, Sahara for $125, and a Moongleam for $235. Emerald Pineapple and Fan 10 inch vase, $45. Emerald Pineapple and Fan 8.5 inch vase, vase $35. And an emerald pineapple and fan, seven and a half inch vase for $25. Three toothpick holders, Prince of Wales plumes with gold, $55. Fancy loop, $30. And pineapple and fan with gold for $35. Have a Sahara dolphin food and water pitcher, $95. Jacobian candlesticks, $135. A flat panel lay down toothpick holder, $25. Moongleam Yeoman handle jug or, or water pitcher, $85. We have one Dawn 20th Century Orange Juice and two Dawn Soda Glasses, and they're all $25 a piece. Emerald Green Pineapple and Fan Butter Dish, $85. Have a number 110 Dolphin Flamingo bedroom lamp with a cutting on it by Ideal Glass Company. Have a Fair Acre perfume in Flamingo for $135. And the lit lamp is $165. And the Crystal Fair Acre perfume is $225. Have a banded flute cake stand, hard to find piece, $375. And an emerald green fancy loop shot glass, $55. Three amber terrain goblets, $40 a piece. Have a helmet basket in Flamingo, $650. We have a diamond point match holder, the hat, and it is $325. Three Alexanderite sherbets, $35 a piece. Beaded panel and sunburst cake basket made out of a cake stand, $125. An abandoned flute, horseradish jar, $25. And in the back, we have a banded flute Chopin for $225. This is table number five. The first item on the list is a Donna water, water pitcher and flamingo with diamond optic, and the price on it is $350. We have 14 tumblers. 
that you can buy separately. Buy as many of these or as few of these as you want, and they're $25 a piece. Have a pair of candle holders here. I think they're Sanfords again, and they're $65 for the pair. Two piece duck flower frog, and it's $2.45 for the set. Fish match holder and crystal frosted, and it's $85. Have a little colonial ice tub, and it's priced $25. Here's a fancy loop bowl that's been all turned up on the edge, really nice shape to it, and it's $175. Big piece of glass. Here's a colonial pitcher, $35. No damage on it. Here's a round colonial basket, the seven inch size, it's unusual in that it's been frosted all over, it's been cut and then polished out to clear. Price on $75. Have a cabochon crit. And it does have a little wheel engraving on it. It's also signed by the person that cut it. And his name is Bach. And I think this guy was out of the Maryland area. $45, no cloud inside. Here's a plantation cruet, one of the prototypes. No pineapples on it. And it's $365. Carcassonne oyster cocktails in cobalt blue, $85 a piece. Mallard with the wings all the way up, price $45. Here's another Empress Crit, all Moongleam, price $125. Six Yeoman Goblets in Flamingo, they're priced $15 each. Mallard with the wings down, the hardest one to find of the three, and it's priced $85. Here's a pair of grape cluster candelabra, and they have the removable bow beshes on them, and they're priced $95 for the pair. Lodestar Dawn Ashtray, $75. Here's a Whirlpool little ivy ball, $12.50, marked in the center of the bottom. Here's a McGrady seven ounce syrup, in Flamingo, it's marked $60. This is probably the second run of these syrups. When they first made them, they had the handle on them and they were breaking at the bottom. So they added a little bit of glass right down here at the bottom. They changed the mold. So this is like the second style of them. Here's a Waverly Cordial, $35. Empress Dolphin Footed Candy in Sahara, $65. High low vase, $225 in Sahara. They call it a high low vase because it's got one handle that's high and one handle that's low. Pair of candle holders, $35 for the pair. Prison band decanter in Flamingo, $235 and it does have a cut stopper with it. Three toed Empress dolphin footed candle holders, $165 for the pair. Here's an Athena candle holder. It says the socket's been glued back on, $6. Here's 305 Putney and Diamond Point, little six inch vase, $22.50. Sleeping Fox ashtray, $275. And the, and the fox has his ears. Usually when they turn these upside down on the table and dish strainer, it knocks the ears off. That one's got complete ears. Here's three rose universal shrimp icers and they're priced $95 a piece. Here's a triplex candle holder, flamingo, $65. Twist water, water pitcher and moon gleam, $165. In good condition, no wear on the body. Have three Spanish orange juice glasses. This one's actually got the original high C Spanish label on the bottom of it. 
and they're priced $65 a piece. Just one of them has a label. Here's a set of three geese. Goose with the wings down is $95. That's the hardest one to find. The one with the wings half up is $15. And the goose with the wings all the way up is $12.50. I believe this is a Spanish footed soda with tally ho etch on it. The price is $35. This is one of the harder blanks to find with tally ho. Here's some universal wines in tally ho, a pulled stem. They're $30 a piece. A Christmas decanter with a cut stopper in it, tally ho design and it's priced $135. Elegant looking piece of glass. Then we have several different sizes of soda glasses here with tally ho on them. They're all in the $20 range. Here's a couple old fashions and they're $18. Here's a one pint of Williamsburg water pitcher, the smallest size. It's got some really nice sterling silver overlay on it. Price is $95. Here's a salad fork, only one. It's marked right here. It's $22.50. Here's a Colonial 1776 bowl, price $35. This is the bowl that the, the actual shield actually stands out from the glass. Orchid etched cocktail glass. $12 and a half. Orchid Edge Princess, this is that hard to find stem, this is Princess, and it's $35 in a sherbet. Patrician Candelabras, they're $135 for the pair. Here's a hairpin basket, we had one the other day. It's got the pattern hairpins on it, but this one has added cutting in between each one of the hairpins. Adds to the price. Price on this one is $525. Point is an oval and diamond point sure bowl in emerald green, and it's priced $10. And it has a chip right there on the side of it. Have three rooster cocktail glasses, and they're priced $22 a piece. A donkey. $85. Another old sandwich bar glass and fancy loop. Emerald green, only $25 on this one. Fandango toothpick holder, $25. Five Duquesne tangerine water glasses, and they're priced $106, $165 a piece. Have a beaded panel and sunburst rare custard glass punch bowl and stand. It's $1,850. And then inside it, we have an original Heise ladle, and it's $125. It has a lip on each side, and it's always ground right here on the bottom. Have Farberware or Farber Brothers a pair of these three light candelabras with Ridgely candle cups as inserts. It's $185 for the pair. If you need sockets for a candelabra, here's your opportunity. Here's more, three more rooster stem cocktail glasses. Again, $22 for the pair. Another donkey for $85. There's a little covered puff box. Sometimes you'll see this with ribs on the inside. This is a soap dish, but this is just a puff box. It's $45. This piece has three functions. In one place in the Vogel book, it's called a toothbrush holder. Another place is called a celery vase. And another place it's called a uh, something else that I've forgotten right now. <laughs> and it is $35. There's a pair of Georgian candle holders, $22.50 for the pair. Round colonial basket with a wheel cutting on it, $75. Here's an emerald green pineapple and fan. Looks to be a 10 inch vase. Beautiful color in this one. It's only $65.
Looks like another eight and a half inch vase, pineapple and fan emerald, it's $35. Helmet basket and flamingo, $650. Sahara Empress mustard and cover, $25. Pair of Mars Moongleam candle holders, $35 for the pair. Check the bases for size. They're close to the same size, which is fine. Old Sandwich Water Pitcher in Sahara. No ice slip on this one, $95. Warwick Horn of Plenty Floral Bowl in Cobalt Blue, $185. Little Octagon Basket in Flamingo, $125. A Delaware Goblet in Hawthorne, $65, and it actually has a little sticker on it that I haven't seen before. At one time, that might have been a Hawthorne-looking sticker. Looks like it had color to it. Octagon Basket, Moongleam, $125. Here's an unusual creamer and sugar. It's in twist, it's footed, $65 for the pair unless you just find the sugar bowl out and then it also doubles as a footed almond. Here's a Brazilian nut, Yeoman, Flamingo, price $15, Diamond Optic. Here's a pair of Victorian two light candle holders in crystal, $85 for the pair. Now we're ready for table number six. We're going to start out with a beaded panel and sunburst punch bowl and a few cups inside it. It's $150 for all of it. Some of the cups have damage. We have several Old Dominion little cordials in Sahara, $65 a piece. Pleat and panel cruet in, in crystal, good shape, no cloud in it, $25. Several rooster head cocktail glasses, $20 a piece. Another mallard with the wings down, $75 this time. Mallard with the wings up, $35. Banded flute cordial, several of them, $25 a piece. We have a Great Key Crystal Buffet Plate. It doesn't go with the punch bowl. It does, it does, but it's not priced with the punch bowl. It's priced $950. Then we have the Greek Key Flamingo Bowl and Stand, and there is a fracture in the stand, and it's $475. It's small, right up at the top. Have a little horseradish jar that's signed right in between the two little black dots. It's got a hollow place in the top, so you can put a spoon inside and put the lid right over the spoon and keep it right with your horseradish. It's $25. Here's a number 500 little Lavender jars, $35, and it's the only lavender jar that Heisey made with a solid stopper. It's called a number 500. It's a Sparrow, $23. Little Priscilla toothpick holder, no decoration, $18. Narrow flute covered candy, $18. Lid comes off, of course. I think this is a Glenford All Flamingo little bar glass, $12.50. Good shape. Putney and Diamond Point cologne bottle with a little sterling silver cap. It's got threads on it, twists off. A Mother Wood Duck, $375. Bonnet Basket and Moongleam, hard to find basket, price $675. We have six Tangerine Duquesne Saucer Champagnes, $95 a piece. Empress Sahara Crypt, nice little wheel cutting on the side, wheel cutting on the top, nice and clean on the inside, priced only $55. Pinwheel and Fan Punch Cup and Moon Gleam, $30. Pair of Waverly Two Light Candle Holders back here. Hard to find candle holders, sometimes they're called flame, and they're, uh, $165 for the pair. And the little Eperns are $10 a piece that are in them. 
I have a Creole Alexanderite goblet, just one of them here. It's $125, and this is a tall stem goblet. Have several horse head cocktails. These are unusual pieces, and they're $275 a piece. Limelight Madonna, very hard to find piece. Price $2,250. We've got two of them sitting right here. Here's a plaid Vaseline opalescent swung vase. It does have a place here on the base that's been broke out and glued back on. Another little chip over there. Extremely rare item. And it's priced $675 because of the damage on it. Have a Christus Moongleam decanter, diamond optic, Moongleam top, Moongleam foot, priced $325. Albemarle cocktails, Moongleam bowl, crystal stem and foot, and there's all four of them are priced $75 for the four. Here's a signet or a baby for the swan, and she's priced $65. Empire Single Candle Holder, $225. Two Fandango Tumblers, good gold on them, only $18 a piece. Heisey's first pattern. Here's a Creel, a very large footed soda, and it's priced $65 in Alexandrite. Wonderful color in this. Another half circle creamer and sugar in Moongleam, priced $115 for the pair. Jack Mendemo candle holder signed on the bottom, marked $8. I have a Waverly Seahorse handle candy jar with Narcissus cutting for $85. Here's a Dinky Doo, does fluoresce under black light. She's been frosted all over. It's $175 and it does turn yellow under a black light. Here's a pair of orchid epernets, very unusual pieces with the orchidettes on the epernet. We have a pair of them and they're $375 a piece. Here's a bonnet basket and flamingo, pretty good color in this one. It's priced $165. Lock it on a chain covered sugar bowl, priced $75. Hard to find basket, narrow flute with rim, price $375. The Sunburst Water Pitcher, priced $175. Here's a non high Z ladle that's just stuck in it. You can have it if you buy the punch bowl. Here's a pair of fish candle holders, $175. And it says one of them has a little flake on it someplace. Yeoman Flamingo Salt Cellars, $8 a piece. Tally Ho Cocktail Shaker with a rooster stopper in it. Clean inside, it's $110. And there's a bunch of universal cocktails sitting around it with a pulled stem on them. And they're $30 a piece. Looks like there's two wines, and they're $35 a piece with Tally Ho. Here's Cut Block Salt Cellars, pretty hard to find, $18 a piece. There's another Greek Key Platter, it's $950. This punch bowl here in Flamingo, the stand and the foot, all in good shape, and it's priced $650. And it also has a ladle inside that's not Heisey. Fish match holder, $85. Another set of elephants, we've gone through several of these. $85 for the baby. $135 for the mother. And the papa's $225. Have two different sizes of beer mugs. They're both Whaley mugs. Have the club drinking scene. Some people call this tavern. Tavern doesn't look anything like this. This is a, it is in a tavern, but it's called club drinking scene. Men sitting around smoking and drinking at a table and a waiter's uh, serving them. 
in the tabernets, what it is, you have a waiter, but he's got his hand up above his head and he's got a hog's head on that platter. That's the actual tavern design. Have two sizes. Here's a smaller size for $55 and the large size for $65. Here's a Lodestar nappy that's been all pushed down. Haven't seen this before. It's priced $35. It's got the original high sticker still on it. Doesn't mean it's original, but it's on there. Here's a very unusual and hard to find piece. Beaded swag, emerald green, cruet with original stopper in it, $675. More Creole goblets, $95 a piece. Excellent color in them. Old sandwich beer mug, $265 in Moon Gleam. This is a smaller size mug. Same thing in Cobalt Blue. It's $245. Here's something that's very unusual. It's an elephant handle beer mug, but they have pulled a spout on the front of it to make a pitcher out of it, or a whimsy pitcher out of it and it's priced $265. A pair of two light grape cluster candle holders. They're $165 for the pair. A hen. She's $225. Frog handled cheese plate, $75. She's got a little frog up here. A fighting rooster, $35. A Dawn Cabochon Quarter Pound Butter Dish, $110. Yeoman Two Ounce Cruet with a Crystal Stopper, $45. Here's a two quart cocktail shaker with tally hole etch. This is significantly bigger than the one quart we've been showing you this evening, and it's $145. And there are four aqua calientes that go with it for $25 a piece. Or if you want shots, the shots are $18 a piece, the tally hill run. And there's eight of those. I believe this is a banded flute chamber stick, even though there's no banded flute design on it. It's signed and it's $45. Here's a high Z. Picket fence basket. It does have a little cutting on the top. This is a high Z cutting on it, and it's priced $65. Here's a shot glass and coronation, $10. And the last piece tonight, we've got an urn, shallow little nappy, $15.